girls, gays, zays, everybody, and all in between. Hello po, magandang umaga po sa ating lahat. Happy May Day! Happy International Day! On this day, May Day, people of all ethnicities join together and celebrate the working class and the worker resistance. Today we are gathered here to commemorate May Day or International Workers' Day, which is a holiday in most countries of the world. The United States is an exception. Today we need to be reminded of those who dedicate their lives to worker rights, to worker solidarity. This May Day, we need, may we remember the LGBT community as not an afterthought or a coincidence or separate from workers, but actually a vital part of our own diverse community. We will not stay quiet while our bosses humiliate and intimidate us. We need health care, we need education, we need homes, and we need liberation. So as Marsha P. Johnson, the queen herself said, there is no pride for some of us without liberation for all of us. And we believe that it is the workers who make this world run. So it is the workers who should run the world. Workers of the world unite! We can do it! We can do it! We can do it! We can do it! So we must continue to militantly fight against homophobia and transphobia. Abate babae, palaban militante, directly translates as unwarred women. Fight militantly. In light of women's power, we encourage you to join us. Viva el primero de mayo. Viva la lucha de los trabajadores. The people are, right, are fighting back, and that's why the wealthy are scared. So I am tired of voting for people who do not represent me. I urge you all today to say no to money in politics and help elect officials who do not take corporate money. Let's dump the lip service Democrats. Especially today, it is the leadership, especially of black, indigenous, brown, trans women that continue to push for our rights, for our welfare, and for the liberation of the LGBTQ, not only here in the U.S., but overall in the world. At the end of the day, as Frederick Douglass says, power can seize nothing without a demand. It never has, and it never will. Dignity, compassion, and respect are the foundation for the community that everybody wants to live in. Solidarity to every worker around the world, and let's demand what workers deserve with dignity, respect, and let's fight for it. Thank you. So today we're here to remember who we are, and we are the working class of Silicon Valley.